hi guys oh my gosh it's been so long welcome back to my channel and welcome to everyone that is new to my channel so i am kicking my return off with my imax haul finally i've been back for like a whole week and i'm finally going to do my imax haul and show you guys everything that i picked up from imax which i had an absolute ball my entire weekend in New York so definitely shout out to that so I'm gonna break it down like how I'm gonna do this video I bought so many lips you guys it is just unbelievable that's almost the only thing that I bought was lipsticks as far as the actual makeup area so for that reason I'm going to record a video based on the actual vendor so every vendor will have their separate video but I'm just going to mention what all I got um, in this video as well as like the additional things um, that I picked up so uh, I know that immediately following this video, my Dosa Colors video is going to go up. And I'm also going to give you guys a review on this hair. So before you guys even ask me about my color, ask me about anything, just make sure that you stay tuned for that video so you can get the details on that. So as always, let's get started, you guys. So to start off, I'm going to start off with Lady Moss. And you guys, oh my, I spent the most money with Lady Moss. Um, good God Almighty. <laughs> so I'm going to start off. I'm going to try to start off with the storage. So the first thing that I'm going to show you guys, and I was so pressed. I, I tried to keep all of my stuff like in the bag. It's been in my front room all week. And yesterday, last night, actually, I just was like, let me take all of this stuff out and just sort of see what I have. But I bought this. This is like a blush container from Lady Moss. Oh my gosh, I love this. This was only $11. And you can't see at the bottom, but their little logo is right there at the bottom. I think it's so super cute. And that was $11. Original price is like $14 on their webpage. I also got the bigger one so as you can see it can hold like bronzers and like bigger powders and this one and I still I actually need another blush one because I didn't realize I had that many blushes so and you see the logo right there on the bottom and I got all clear storage um the next thing which is really big so I have to like y'all gonna see me leave the uh, the screen the um frame and then come back i'm gonna try to pick this up you guys. so the other major thing that i picked up from lady moss which was a big reason why i went to imax was my lipstick storage so here she is you guys my lipstick tower i'm gonna try to <laughs> this is how i gotta give you guys like a pan view of my lipstick tower and it really does spin around so it's a um a spinner like at the bottom and I'm trying to spin it in my hand so here are all my lipsticks I'm not sure if this 114 or 116 I'm not sure which one it is but yeah I kind of took everything out and it's all in here so that's my lipstick tower and the logo is right up here at the top but that's a lot so I'm gonna put this down so next from Lady Moss I picked up a lot of like tools like so I picked up some shadow shields so you guys can see these, and I used these for the first time today, and they're pretty good. Um, it doesn't make or, like, I don't think it makes or break your makeup at all. So I picked up four LA Girl Pro Concealers from Lady Moss, and I picked it up in Chestnut. Chestnut and Espresso, and these guys are literally one shade away from each other, so that's why they look so close. I really think my color is Chestnut, just judging by the two, but I haven't tried them on. And then I got another Warm Honey, and I got Fawn, and that is also like one shade away from each other. So I just wanted to try them on, try these as highlighters, and then um, just match my color with that. So I picked up those four LA Girl Pro Concealers. I picked up from Lady Moss some cocoa. Oh, you can't see this. Some cocoa lash glue. I was really looking for the Revlon one, but I did not see that at all. So, yeah. Um, and the next thing I did, you guys, I have them stored in the Lady Moss bag, which I love this bag and I love their logo. Oh my gosh, I love Lady Moss. But um, I 
I have a bag. I don't know if you guys can see this. A bag full of lashes. I racked up. I brought like 20 pair of lashes, four of everything. And I actually have some stuff in my cart because I'm about to order some stuff from Lady Moss as well. But I got some Bellas. And these are Bellas. And y'all have seen me with all of these lashes on. This is a new lash. This was my first time picking this one up. And it's Misha. So you guys can see that. Misha's. I picked up some Ariel's. So super cute. Oh, wait. I'm trying to help you guys. See. I'm a Foxy's. Really, really fancy, honey. Fancy. These are Foxies. And, of course, you guys know I cannot get lashes without getting some goddess lashes. So, those are the five types that I um, picked up in lashes from Lady Moss. I'm trying to think, was there anything else from Lady Moss that I picked up before moving right along? And I don't think that there is. So the next thing, uh, where do I go? Where do I go? Oh, Alcone. So Alcone was here this year. And I wanted a black beauty. Was another like awesome deal. Like, oh my gosh. This was like one of the best deals that I got as far as going to IMAX. I just wanted the black, black beauty blender. But I got all three of the regular size ones. Plus the little baby lime green one and a solid for 30 five dollars you guys this uh, the three alone is sixty dollars regular price so i got 50 percent off of this little package deal of beauty blenders so i now have the purple i have the red i have two pink ones i have the white the black and i have the little baby one the little lime green one and i have a silent also from Alcone, like even though it comes with like, like a small salad to clean it with, I brought the regular size one uh, for Beauty Blender. And I also picked up like this little cute two-sided pencil sharpener because I had like a regular little pencil sharpener and I just feel like it really does chew up my pencil. So I need Most importantly, you guys, finally I have got gotten my damn hands on period spirit brush cleanser i heard so much about this over the years from imax attendees and i finally got my hand on a bottle as well as the jar so yeah I, so listen you guys it was my goal to go to sigma second the first place i wanted to go was dose of colors because i kind of knew that they would be busy I went to Sigma second and they already had like an enormous line. But in standing in line, they brought around like little booklets so you can like, you know, know what you want. And I realized they did not have the purple brush set. So I got out of line and I was like, I can't do Sigma, honey. I'm just going to uh, order the brushes offline regular price. So I ended up because I really needed to get some more brushes, you guys. I ended up going to this brush company. Beedalum. Hopefully, so you got hopefully you guys can see it. Um, and I got I found these really cute purple brushes. I got like a five-piece eye set, and I brought like this separately. I brought this pink one, and this is like the vegan line, like the colored ones. I used some of the brushes today so I had like this smudge brush I used that today for my makeup I used this one what else I used this purple one I really like them and my favorite one is this angle side like liner brush yeah definitely a fave out of the new brushes that I picked up so I really really I really, really like these brushes. Next thing that I picked up from iMatch, you guys, which in my opinion was another amazing deal. I went to Tarte. And you guys, I was so shocked. Tarte line was next to nothing when I got in it. But as I sat in the line, it got enormously long. So I picked the right time to go to Tarte. And I just got three brushes. Um, 
I just got three blushes from Tarte. And this was such an amazing deal because these uh, regular price is $26. These damn things was $10, y'all. Oh, my goodness. That is such a bomb deal. Like, when you're talking about more than 50% off, like, that's a bomb deal. So, I picked up Fearless. And I'm sorry, you guys. There's a mirror in this. And hopefully, you guys can see this. This is Fearless. It's kind of pink. I did pick up mainly, like, pinkish colored ones. I got... This is Blushing Bride. Blushing Bride is really pretty. I think Blushing Bride is, like, the closest one that has, like, some purple undertones to it. And the last one, which is Doll Face. I really, really like Doll Face. This is, like, a really soft uh, pink color. So I really like Doll Face. And hopefully you guys can see those. So I picked up those yeah. three. The next thing I picked up, you guys, was a series of lip products. So I'm just going to name the place that I got them and how many. So here are my lip tars. I put them in a lipstick holder since all of my lipsticks is in my tower. I got these three. These two back here are new, and these two right here are new. So, I got a total of seven lip tars, and I'm going to do a separate video for OCC, like swatching them and trying them on, as you guys know that I love to do. Another one that I picked up, I picked up three Anastasia Beverly Hills um, matte lips, and I was very surprised. Her line went very smoothly, and, you know, they had, like, a pretty decent system with Anastasia. The only thing I will say is that, like, girls was there, really getting like consultations trying to get themselves matched and things like that like you can kind of tell there was a lot of people like a lot of newbies in the IMATS this year which was really weird because I felt like they kind of held up the process for everybody else that that knew what they wanted it was a lot of opportunity to like swatch and stuff like that like we don't swatch at IMATS you See what you want and you have your list and you pick it up and you go. Like, you know. So, I picked up a total of six Dose of Color um, Liquid Matte Lips. That was all I picked up from Dose of Colors. And this video is going to be following. I'm going to show you guys what all of these look like. I am definitely wearing Bury Me today. And I really like their, I love the consistency and everything um, so much of the one that I tried. So, stay tuned for that video. So, I wanted to try like a few new places. And I picked up six lips, you guys, from L.A. Splash. So, I picked up six of their like tinted mousses. And yes, you guys, you are seeing these colors in real flesh honey real popping colors i cannot wait to swatch and make a video of this and as you guys can tell on average i picked up about six lips from everybody and that's why i want to do like a separate video because it'll definitely be long enough for you guys to like really want to watch it and but not too long because i felt like if i did all of that in this video, y'all be on here for forever. So, the next place that I picked up about six lips from was Inglot. I picked up a series of lipsticks from Inglot. And I'm going to show you guys all of those. And definitely swatch and show you what these look like. And for whatever reason, you guys, whenever we go to IMATS, even though we're going to IMATS, it is impossible for us to go to New York and not go to Mac and not go to Sephora. So, I'm going to show you guys what I got from Sephora, which was a little bit of stuff because I was truly makeup out and it was just nothing that I really needed in there. So, I one thing I did pick up is a Luster Matte Long Wear Lip, one of their lipstick. And this is the Sephora brand. And this was really, 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 really nice when we sort of swatched it in the store. A real pretty new color. So, I'll show you guys. I'll throw this in with, like, one of the other ones. And, of course, you guys know that my birthday was two weeks ago. So, of course, Sephora sent me a birthday gift. And I got it when I was in New York, which was the NARS Beauty Insider, like, the lip pencils. The red one is matte, and the the it's, like, a new one in there that has like a cream sheen kind of finish to it so yeah this was my birthday gift and I decided to just pick that up I also picked up a travel size of my moisturizer because I took the like I'm trying to be smarter with packing so I just picked up a travel size of that and 
I also picked up two gray eyeshadows. All of my gray eyeshadows are like have a shimmer to it. So I really wanted to get some that did not. And these Sephora brand ones were so pigmented. I wanted to try it. Like, um, so I picked those two up. Oh, something that I forgot to mention with OCC. I bought two OCC lip pencils in Lydia and Black Delilah. Y'all, these pencils are everything. Thing. So this is Lydia. And I love it. And I love that lip tar. And this is Black Delilah. And Black Delilah kind of puts me in the mind of like Karen and Night Moth. But I really, really love that pencil. Lydia, I have nothing like it. So that was such a great purchase. And I think those were like $12. I don't know how much they are regular price. I really think so from Mac I got some brush cleanser I got some concealer because I made a mistake and left mine home and from their new collection that just came out I picked up this eyeshadow this soft lavender eyeshadow called wow factor and it's a matte so it is really really cute it's really pretty lavender purple like a lilac color wouldn't really say lavender and I picked up a purple eyeliner pencil called evil twin I'm actually wearing it right Right now and this is one of the few purple eyeliner pencils that really just like already shows up purple and like popping other ones I have to lace it with um, eyeshadow in order to get the color to really show up but that is evil twin right there really really pretty color that and like deep blue C I think it's like the navy blue one that I wear two really good eyeshadow two really good eyeliners so yeah you guys that is it for my IMAX haul. I had such an amazing time this year. And next year, you guys, I am actually coming to LA. So I'm so excited to go to IMAX LA next year. And I do not think we, I don't think I'll be doing New York. I'm not really sure. If I do, I'll probably only come up for like that day or something like that. So yeah, I hope you guys love this video. And stay tuned for my Dose of Colors video, which is going to follow this video. In addition, I am going to do a hair review for my Maven hair that's in my head that I owed you guys from so long ago. But as always, you guys, welcome again. But again, you guys, welcome to my channel for all of my new subscribers. And hello to my old. And until the next time, bye, beauty.